there every day. I'm enjoying watching him grow as a comedian. He has his own YouTube page and also a comedy page on Facebook. Y'all check it out. I'll let him shout it out. Coming to the stage. Money, Mike Lou. What's up, Kalia? Peace. Y'all been dead in here the past couple weeks. What's going on? Everybody funny? Fuck it. Right. Remember me from last time. I'm the token nigga. For y'all that don't know, remember that. I'm the token nigga. Uh, Charlie Sheen, I mean Charlie Stone. You good. Look, this is how we're going to do it. All the white people, we're going to go like this. I'm, 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 the white people, you say token. Okay? Black people, you say nigga. Okay? Let's go. Now, here we go. White people. Token. Black people. Nigga. Okay, let's switch that. Okay. Black people, you gonna be token. White people, you gonna be nigga. Don't be scared. Hey, Charlie, don't be scared. Okay. Black people. Token. White people. Token. No! <laughs> you didn't want that ass whooped. No, I didn't want that. No, that's some real shit, though, man. I always lose shit, man. Don't y'all hate when you lose shit? I hate when I lose shit. I just had. Fucking fucked around and lost my job, man. Anybody know somebody hiring a token nigga? I guess once you fired as a token nigga, your token ain't worth shit. That shit like Canadian change and shit. Fuck that shit. My job was dope though. I got people at uh, fucking work that I'm hella cool with, but it's like everybody says nigga. I didn't really keep a job that long to you know just be in some place where I can realize. Everybody said nigga as much. Not like back when we was young. When I was young, just to be like, oh, he said nigga. He called me a nigga or a nigger, so I'm going to beat his ass. Okay, well, beat his ass. It wasn't nothing even to talk about. Now, motherfuckers, this is like whatever. So I go to work. Everybody says nigga. I go through the door. Boom, what's up, nigga? Mind you, I'm the token nigga, so therefore I'm the only nigga there, right? So it's like you can only be talking to one motherfucker. So what's up, my nigga? What's up, my nigga this, nigga that? So Santa Claus time, you know, Christmas, I wanted to be Santa Claus, but I didn't fucking realize if I wore the Santa suit at work that it was like a setup to me, because everybody was like, that's not fucking Santa, he's fucking black, and shit like that, so I go to work, and I go through the door after, I work, Christmas been over, it's like fucking January 7th, I go through the door, they're like, what's up, nigga Claus, I'm like, what the fuck, I was Santa Claus one time, and all of a sudden I'm nigga Claus, but that's good, though, you know, I love my people I work with, shout out to y'all, um, I got a cousin, man. He just came to stay at my house. He's on parole. He just did some time, but it's cool, though. You know what I mean? Um, and I'm an R&B dude, you know what I mean? So I listen to R&B music all the time and shit. So he gets out of jail. He comes to me like, what's up, little nigga? And I'm like, what's good? He's like, what you listening to? I'm like, oh, some Trey songs. Isn't that gay ass shit? No, no bitches want to hear that shit. And I'm like, yeah, right. Bitches love Trey songs. So I'm going to fucking be Trey, and it's going to be going to go upstairs, and the neighbor's going to fucking know my name. And he's like, oh, fuck that, little nigga. Your ass is going to listen to 50 Cent and all that shit. And Tupac, I was like, I don't really, I like Tupac, but I don't really like listening to a dead motherfucker just talking to me all the time. Like, hey, this nigga dead, and then now he on the track with T-Pain? Bullshit, you got me fucked up. That's not how <laughs> shit goes. But it's like, you go, he's like one of the motherfuckers who want to take the blame for every fucking thing that he, that, that, it doesn't even matter. It's just like, girls want a tough nigga. So you got to be like, Whoa, and shit. So if you do something, you got to take the blame for it. I was like, no, okay. If I do some shit, you take the blame for it. He was like, okay, cool. So he got into this character and shit. He was like, who ate all the cereal? And the nigga was like, I ate the cereal. Nigga, so what? What you gonna do? I'm like, okay, cool. So he liked it a little bit too much. He used to do it in front of girls. We used to have this thing where it's like, no bagging on each other in front of girls. Don't make yourself at all awkward in front of the girls and stuff like that. Cool. Whatever. So we have a party. And... I'm in there, I've got the Trey songs on, and I turn it. I mean, he turns it. I'm like, who turned it? He's like, I'll turn that shit. We finna listen to Tupac. And I'm like, okay, cool, cool, cool. He can't just punk me in front of the girls like that. He got me fucked up. And so I'm like, okay, I got this nigga. This is what he do. He sleep on the couch and shit. So all the bitches is walk. He sleep on the couch and shit. So I wake up. I was like, man, who sucked the cat's dick? He was like, I did that shit. It was on me. I did that shit. So I'm like, <laughs> so I'm like okay, I bet your ass did. <laughs> but, Nah, but uh, I feel like y'all remember me from the last time, whatever. I told y'all, fuck with white people, I love white people, but you gotta have a nigga sensor, it's like a mother's intuition, but I call it a nigga's intuition, you know what I mean? So it's like when you getting ready to do some 
too white shit, your nigga censor should kick in and be like, no, niggas don't do that. You know what I mean? So I had this white girl, she was like, let's go to the stratosphere and do the bungee jump thing. And I was thinking like, okay. And then my nigga said, she was like, no, niggas don't do that. And I was like, well, you know what? I'm kind of scared of heights a little bit. We can just go watch a movie or some shit like that. Or whatever. In case my man's was just like, no, I want to need some spontaneousness and stuff. Well, let's go ride the roller coaster at New York, New York. And I'm just like, Okay, that sounds cool. I like roller coasters, but then my nigga sister kicked in like that's an old ass motherfucking roller coaster. And you know what? I don't. I got a thing where I don't ride roller coasters outside of California because I just think that roller coaster riding is for California and shit like that. So she was just like, okay, cool. So I got another friend. We all talked to white girls. So he calls me one day. I'm hella little. He has this big ass truck. It's fucking big as fuck. Whatever. He calls me. He's like, man, what are you doing? I'm like, I'm gonna go smoke some weed. He was like, okay, before you smoke some weed, I need you to come help me. And I'm like, what? He's like, my truck got stuck in the desert. I'm like, what the fuck? So I had to remember who I was talking to. Like, this, is it, yeah. this nigga black in his truck is in the desert. Okay. What the fuck am I supposed to do to help you get your truck out the desert and shit? Like, whatever. So I go, I'm like, fuck, I can't leave my friend. So I get all the way down there. Ooh, I can't see him from miles. He's like, I can see you, but I can't see this nigga. And I'm like, okay, whatever. So I see him, I jump out, and I jump out the car. I'm like, nigga, did your nigga sister kick you in? What the fuck you doing out here? You out here with a white bitch and two dogs and your truck is stuck in the motherfucking desert? What the fuck is going on? And he's just like, man, I know my nigga sister kicked in, but it was too late. I was fucked up. And I was like, because that's because you're doing other drugs besides just smoking weed and shit. But your nigga sister should have kicked in. For all y'all that don't got a nigga sensor, get y'all one. I'll be your nigga sensor. <laughs> No, I don't want none of your brothers. <laughs> I like y'all, man. Y'all kind of laughing with me, vibing with me. Um, who watched the Super Bowl? I know Twist. You watch the Super Bowl? Of course, you watch the Super Bowl. Fuck the Giants, anyways. Nah, I'm just bullshit. Nah, but uh, I love y'all, man. Check me out, man. Mike, Mike, five two zero zero four on YouTube. Holla at me, Mike. Yeah!